Welcome to today's edition of the AII, watching stock news, deal tracker, and advancements in artificial intelligence. Hello everyone, this is Sam Mowers here. Welcome to another episode of the AII podcast. For stock news today, GBT's Korean patent application for its 3D multiplanar IC tech has been granted and Synopsys has launched the Synopsys AI Suite. Then we're going to take a look at some projections for the global artificial intelligence market. But just before we get into the show today, a quick reminder, as always, that if you enjoy this podcast, please feel free to share it or leave us a review. Additionally, I highly recommend checking out some of the other podcasts on InvestorIdeas.com. This includes the Cannabis Podcast, the Clean Tech and Climate Change Podcast, and many others I could go on. All of them, however, will bring you up to speed on the latest stock news and trends in their respective spaces. All right, so GBT Technologies, Inc., which trades on the OTC Pink under the ticker symbol GTCH, has announced that the patent application for its 3D multiplanar IC design and manufacturing technology was granted on March 7th in South Korea. This patent seeks to present a new way to design and manufacture immense size integrated circuits to fit advanced analog, digital, and mixed type integrated circuits on a silicone wafer aiming to enable advanced microchips design and manufacturing using significantly less silicone space. The goal of GBT's 3D MP chip architecture according to the press release is to enable the design of memory chips, CPU, GPU, AI chips on much smaller die, resulting in significant cost reduction, lower power consumption, and better performance. Next up for today, we have Synopsys Inc., which trades on the NASDAQ under the ticker symbol SNPS, which has launched Synopsys AI, described as a suite of AI-driven solutions for the design, verification, testing, and manufacturing of the most advanced digital and analog chips at its annual Synopsys Users Group, or SNUG, or SNUG, Silicon Valley Conference. This, according to the press release, enables engineers to use AI at every stage of chip design, from system architecture to design and manufacturing, and access the solutions in the cloud. Shankar Krishnamurthy, the GM of Synopsys EDA Group, explained, quote, Increased complexity, engineering resource constraints, and tighter delivery windows were challenges crying out for a full AI-driven EDA software stack from architectural exploration to design and manufacturing, and we've delivered it. With Synopsys AI Solutions, our customers' ability to search design solution spaces across multiple domains is in hyperdrive. They're finding optimal results far faster as the AI learns to run to run, learns run to run rather, and it's transforming their ability to meet and beat tough design and productivity targets. End quote. We'll leave stocks there for the day and take a look now at a report published by Market.us which finds that the global market for artificial intelligence in general is projected to grow from 129.8 billion USD in 2022 to 2.745 trillion dollars by 2032 registering a compound annual growth rate of 36.8% in the forecast period 2023 to 32 the following excerpt from the report's overview outlines some key factors influencing the market's growth. Quote, One major driver of the AI market is its capacity to enhance efficiency and accuracy. This helps businesses achieve higher productivity and profitability. For instance, AI-powered chatbots can assist customer service teams in handling more requests quickly. The AI market's growth can be attributed to the vast investments and collaborations made. This leads to new technologies like autonomous vehicles, robotics, and quantum computing. Along with that, favorable government initiatives are also contributing to positive market growth. But there are ethical concerns about AI, including privacy violations, bias, and job displacement. Therefore, responsible AI that is transparent, explainable, and accountable is increasingly emphasized. 
And that's it for today's AII. If you would like to be a guest or sponsor for this podcast, contact InvestorIdeas.com. Investor Ideas reminds all listeners to read our disclaimers and disclosures on the InvestorIdeas.com website. And this podcast is not an endorsement to buy products or services or securities. Investors are reminded all investment involves risk and possible loss of investment. To hear more InvestorIdeas.com podcasts, please visit InvestorIdeas.com slash audio. And a reminder, you can also hear our podcasts on Apple Podcasts, Audible, Spotify, TuneIn, Stitcher, Spreaker.com, iHeartRadio, and most audio platforms available. To learn more about GBT Technologies, Inc., please visit goforprotocol.com or visit the InvestorIdeas.com profile page at InvestorIdeas.com slash CO slash G-O-P-H and for disclosure purposes, GBT Technologies is a PR news and social media featured company on InvestorIdeas.com.